And I hate speaking on tapes like this, so I don't know how I'll do, but I have a guarantee, and that is that this will be short and sweet, but I really do want to say a few words concerning my feelings about when my parents received their mission call and now that they are coming back from their mission. And first of all, I want to say that I'm very, very grateful for what they are doing. I was so proud of them when they received their mission call. It was wonderful. They received their call to go to Hong Kong, and we were all very surprised and very, very excited. And it was really, really neat to see their excitement, their enthusiasm, as they went to the MTC to learn to speak Cantonese. And they were going to go with all of their energy and fervor, and it was really, really exciting to see that. I loved it, and I was really, really happy. We were all very, very excited. And I knew that my parents would be wonderful missionaries because of what great teachers they've always been, because of the love and the giving attitude that they've always had. They went into the MTC learning Cantonese, and they were there for a while, and then their mission call was changed. And after a pause, they went to Sacramento, California to be mission presidents. And even though this was a major change, this time it felt even more right to me, knowing that they were going to be going as mission presidents to Sacramento, California. Because in my mind, they've always been such great leaders. This was the right calling for them. And it was really, really exciting. And it was exciting to watch them and to see them go. They went into the MTC again. And then they went to Sacramento. And as I thought about it, I knew in my heart that my mom would be the best mission mom that there ever was. She has always been a very, very loving, very giving, very patient, tolerant, long-suffering mother, and very, very kind with us children. And now that she's a mission mom, she's had the opportunity to be the mom to a whole bunch of kids. And there's not been a better mother in the whole world. She is so loving and so fun to be around and so pleasant and so kind and a beautiful person. And I'm really proud of her. I know she's been a wonderful mission mom, and I'm really grateful that these missionaries had the opportunity to have her for their mother for these three years. And then there's my dad. I'm so proud of his abilities, his leadership abilities, and his knowledge of the scriptures, and his ability to speak and to teach. He's really amazing to listen to. He can bring the scriptures to life in his speeches and in his talks. And he can relate it to our lives and make us really feel them. And he is such a strong leader and such a wonderful, fun person to be around also. My parents are great leaders. They're very, very loving and very, very giving. And I'm sure that the sacrifices that they have put forth to be mission presidents these three years have been very much appreciated by the Lord that he approves of what they have done and that he loves them very much. I'm sure that the Lord is very, very proud of them and very grateful for their service. I'm sure that the missionaries that they have served over have been extremely grateful for the fact that they have been their mission presidents these three years. I am very grateful that they had this opportunity to teach the gospel because I was raised by them and I have a strong testimony of the church. I was taught the scriptures and I was taught the truths of the gospel all of my life and I have a deep love for the church. And I'm very, very grateful for the leadership that they showed me and for all that they did for me in my life. And now I'm grateful that they've had the opportunity to serve as mission presidents. I want to also say that I'm grateful for the example that they have put forth for my children. As I have three boys, there are three future missionaries, and they have seen my mom and dad as mission presidents, and they have seen the importance of being missionaries and of being the wonderful leaders that they have been. I'm very, very, very grateful for the very grateful for their 
um, leadership and for their example that they've set for my children has been very, very important and significant for them. I'm grateful for the opportunity that I have had to support them on their mission. With my prayers, even though I haven't been good at letter writing, I, my prayers have always been with them very much, every day. I love my parents very much. And I'll close now, and I'll see you in July, Mom and Dad. And congratulations for all your great work. Bye-bye.